what's going on everybody um, I was gonna make this a one video for the 55 update but my battery died on my phone so I'm having to make this a two-part ordeal all right second part uh, starting off with the Amazon sword it's still in the play about the same place it was in part one uh, I just decided to leave it there and if you go up here I put the breeder box and inside the breeder box is two pieces of a uh, water sprite I put in with the betas that I propagated uh, I'm gonna let them grow out and I think I'm gonna put that water sprite in the beta tank when I get done with it uh, not sure yet uh, all the guppies are swimming around. Next is this sick piece of driftwood. Uh, Anubius Nana. And the rock here is keeping this kind of leveled. Because uh, my gravel is uh, and dirt is at a slope. But uh, Anubius Nana. And then I took my java fern and I separated it. So that it would grow thicker and it would look like I have more. Have one piece there uh, in the front. In between these two, I put three crypts. They're going to grow out and bush right here. Uh, across here, I have well water sprites back here in the back. When it gets big and bushy, it's going to look really good back here. Uh, the Java fern is all the way across this long piece of uh, driftwood uh, and then over here in the right corner I put the two epungenous plants together the spider wood I tied another piece the second uh, Anubius Nana to that piece so it would grow up so it would grow up here uh, and then I have my banana plant over here in the back corner behind the spider wood, uh, I'm going to propagate some of the water sprite so it would be growing up over there. And then throughout the bottom, I'm going to get uh, dwarf hair grass to grow a carpet. Uh, back up here with the camera. And camera don't do justice for this piece of driftwood on how big it really is. Uh, it's just amazing uh, these three pieces of driftwood uh, in these tanks uh, I got all three pieces 80 bucks uh, this piece was 30 bucks uh, the piece in the uh, 75 was 30 bucks and the piece in the 56 was 20 bucks And the 55 is 48 inches. Of course, everybody knows that from uh, left to right <clears throat> or the length of it, but it is just massive. Uh, overall, I'm pleased with it. Uh, I can't wait to see how this tank is going to turn out. Uh, if y'all have any questions, comments, uh, feel free to leave them uh, if y'all have any ideas of what other kind of plant I could put in here uh, <clears throat> feel free to let me know uh, yeah I'm just stoked about the driftwood and, you know the uh, pet place I got it well I'll leave that for another video <clears throat> Uh, the big, I will say this, the big Anubius Congensa, I think that's how you pronounce it, that was on the spider wood. I took it off and tied it to a rock and put it in the 75 with the cichlids. If they eat it, that's fine. If they tear it up, that's fine. I don't care. Uh, I don't have anywhere to, really to put it to a, and it's got a bunch of that brown, sand, brownish black sandpaper stuff on the leaves and I, tried getting it off uh, 
couldn't do it, so the Ziggler's tear it up, you know, that's fine. But, uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs>